Howdy, I'm Brandon. My goal is to help your snowboarding trip be as awesome as possible. Today, I'm gonna to review the Monkey Forest Ski or Snowboard Goggles. First off, I just wanna disclose, uh, they did send these to me to review, and I wanted to um, test them out before you know I sent out the review, so I've been testing them here in Vail. We've had some beautiful sunny conditions, which is perfect for uh, this lens. Uh, the best thing about uh, the Monkey Forest Goggles is that they got a quick, easy, interchangeable lens system so you, you can buy uh, multiple spare lenses you know to fit the conditions that you're in so you can start with you know one like this made for sunny days then you could get one of the low light lenses and um, plop it on for you know those powder days or the overcast days and then also uh, one of the best things I think for a goggle like this is you could get a clear lens so if you're gonna do any night skiing maybe at Keystone or also if you're gonna go uh, do indoor snowboarding, you know, where you don't have to worry about, you know, the sun damaging your eyes. You can get some uh, clear lenses just to help you uh, see as awesome as possible in those low light uh, conditions. And one of the things that I really found and really loved about these goggles is the ventilation system. So it has uh, three layers of foam to help maximize the ventilation. And then also it has a double thermal lens. So you can see there, there's a little bit of space in between the inner and outer lens. And that's the same technology used in um, like a tumbler, like a Yeti cup, just because air is actually the greatest insulator. And that little buffer of air uh, creates a temperature differential. So you have the cold on your outer lens and then the inner lens gets heated up from your body heat. And that's what causes the fog is that temperature difference. And that little piece of air, you know, helps prevent that. And also in addition, you know, to the awesome ventilation, the really great um, thermal lens. It also has an anti-fog coating, so you should never have a problem with these fogging, which is really nice because you know foggy goggles could you know ruin your day on the mountain. One thing I loved about these goggles uh, from my, when I first unboxed them was just they look really cool. And the best thing is it has huge uh, peripheral vision, so when you're wearing them, you can't even tell you're wearing goggles because you can just see. You know, I can see my hands here. So it just helps you a ton and it I think this is a safety feature on the mountain because especially if you're a snowboarder you know you need to look over your shoulders when you're carving it up and uh, this just helps you be able to do that you know see someone maybe flying by you or that might hit you so this just helps you be extra safe on the mountain the wide angle view and the the wide cylindrical lens that helps minimize distortion so you can see it's clearly on the mountain and also it helps uh, with depth perception so you can see all the little ruts and you know little things that might be in the snow that you want to watch out for so really I think you know these goggles you know they're gonna help you be as safe as possible on the mountain in terms of being able to see and also you know because the interchangeable lens is so easy and you know they're pretty affordable to get some spare lenses you know you could have the right lens for the right conditions so you can see as best as possible All right, another benefit of having a super wide goggle like this is it actually fits It can fit over glasses. Yes, I can, as you can see, you know, I got some pretty big glasses. You know, it fits right over them. I'm gonna take them all off. Yeah, so uh, this would be a great goggle to check out if you do wear glasses. Uh, one thing to note on the interchangeable lenses, it has eight magnets and they're pretty strong. So it pops in and off easy, but you know, you gotta snag at it uh, decently. So they're not gonna, it's not gonna fall off. You know, if you crash, you know, I, I was practicing some switch, some 180s today on the mountain. Uh, I took a little tumble and no issues. They didn't shift or the lens didn't pop off. So if you're worried about that, it's not an issue. And then another thing is it has, it has this highly grippy strap, which is super nice. If you're like me, if you wear your goggles over your helmet, you know, a strap like this, it doesn't shift at all. You know, I've had some goggles where, you know, they pop off and then, you know, if you pull your goggles up, to eat or something, uh, then like your goggles go flying off. That didn't happen with these because that strap, I put it in place in the morning, it didn't move at all all day. So that was, this is probably the best strap I've had of any goggles. So that's that's nice. That's uh, The strap's normally not something you think about with goggles, but you know, this is pretty much the nicest strap that you can get. And one thing with the frames is they're kind of a rubbery material. And I feel like from normal use on the mountain skiing, snowboarding, you know, you're never gonna break this frame. And when I first got these, uh, I didn't wanna look up any of the information, not the price or anything. I just wanted to have uh, an unbiased opinion to test them out. So I tested them out for a while, 
and I also showed them to some friends and family, kind of asked them what they cost. The average answer was between two to three hundred dollars and looking at them, you know, that's kind of what I expected. They looked really high end. So a lot of people thought you know, these goggles, they look really cool, which is a nice bonus. You know, you always want to look good on the mountain. But then I was so surprised when I looked up the price. These are only $25 on Amazon. If you compare that to, you know, from five years ago, what entry level goggles were like, they looked horrible, they fogged all the time. So these are just exponentially better than those, you know, cheaper goggles from the past. So just cause, you know, the price is low doesn't mean the quality is low. I mean, these have really impressed me. I think this is the favorite pair of goggles I've ever owned. I've used uh, multiple Oakleys, Outdoor Masters, you know, pretty much every major brand and a lot of the cheaper ones too. And uh, you know, these ones really surprised me. These were, I love, to, uh, te I love testing these out and I'd highly recommend them. If you wanna check them out, as I said, they're $25 on Amazon and I'll put the link in the description.